Good morning, one and all. I'm Ananya Gupta. And I'm Arnav Mathur. We are here to present our Atal Marathon project based on the idea AI for elderly. Welcome to our video. We hope you are doing well. Before going to the topic, we should understand what AI is and how it is important in our lives. Artificial intelligence or AI is the ability of a digital computer or a computer controlled robot to perform tasks commonly associated with intelligent beings. We are going to present based on the topic AI for elderly care. When we first hear the idea of AI and elderly care, we think about how an elderly person can use AI devices. In this thought, we have somewhere forgotten that AI can actually help our elders a lot. After a certain age, people are not capable to do their work. They require some help. But the present generation does not have time for them as they are too busy in their own work. In such a situation, technology or simple to use devices can be of real help for the elderly. Here are some advantages of AI for the elderly. To solve this problem, we have designed a simple and easy to use device that every elder person is in need for and can easily use. If we imagine a situation of an elderly person sitting on a wheelchair and he or she has a problem walking but they want some medicines and are unable to find them. In this case, they can use our smart app on their mobile phone and click on the required medicine. Our smart drone will sense where the object is through sensors and will pick up the object by the help of the claws attached to it and will bring the object to the elderly person. This is the sample model of the drone that will be used in our project. We would be making the frame using wood as it is eco-friendly and sustainable. Then we fix the motors to the four ends of the drone and attach the propellers. Then we attach the ESCs to the bottom of the frame. Then we add the landing gear and the claws which will help us to mount and take off and to pick up items. After making the structure, we add the flight controller that is really necessary as it allows the drone to stay stable while in flight. Then we connect it to the river pilot and add sensors according to our requirement. We program the drone based on the necessity and connect it to the app. Then the user will install the application on their mobile phone and mount it on their wheelchair as shown. And our device can then be used by them which will help them access their commonly used assets easily.